Hey everybody, it's Tamika and I am back to share with you guys a mini album that I created using the beautiful Street Lace Paper Collection from Die Cuts with the View. I'm sorry I can't get all of this in there, but um, one of my friends had this paper or is addicted to this paper and I was teasing her about it and then she showed it to me because um, I'd never seen it and um, I went and got it at Michael's because I thought this paper would look so pretty on um, a mini album that I'm creating for... Um, I'm going somewhere, I'm traveling for my birthday, so um, I wanted to put some pictures in it. So I am going to show you, using this paper, I'm going to show you what I created. And the mini album I created is inspired from Kathy over at Paper Phenomenon. So here it is. So super excited. Ah, so cute. Okay. Um, <laughs> I, this is my first, I'm trying to zoom out here. This is my first um, box that I made, box mini album that I created, and I am so excited about it. It turned out perfectly for me. Um, there are some things that when I make my next one I will change or do differently that I missed, but I love it. Um, so here it is. This is the front, and of course this paper is gorgeous, and I got these buckles from Joann's that I had in my stash. And here's a charm. Here's a charm. I don't know if you guys can see it. This says Destination Unknown. It's like a dog tag. And then there's a key and then a little um, pearl down at the bottom. And then one of these Prima trinkets from Marion. Oh, I could have pulled this out. I was going to use this like a passport, like your passport or your, your um, you know how they do, um, like you're graduating and everybody signs your little book. So I'm going to use this as that kind of a book so everybody's going to sign something cute in it so this is what it looks like on the inside i have this cute little charm that's the same charm that i was just showing you hang it from the back and that tucks right in there so cute and then i just have a little t luggage luggage tag hanging off the side and all this is paper love it i got these hinges from um a backgammon box that i ripped apart and that those this little clasp was on there as well as this leather handle. This part here is Tyvek and cardstock, and then those are brads. But this is the leather piece that I snapped on top. And definitely what I'll do next time, since the mini album has charms and stuff in it, it's a little heavier. I will add another handle right here and then connect these two together. So that's one thing that I will change. And then here's the sides the back gorgeous 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 and the bottom I love it so I'm going to show you what's inside so it opens like that you can see that it's the top of the luggage and then I have on the sides I have it um some ribbon and some buttons to keep the mini album from flinging back too far and then that's just the inside I love the paper I just dressed everything in black soot I got from Angie so yeah it does make a difference when you use um, like real distressing ink it makes everything look cute so anyway this is my box set that aside and show you my album I love it. And then I, I bind, uh, use Kathy's binding method, or, or yeah, I use Kathy's binding method. And then I didn't like the the um, straightness of the, the rigidness of it, so I, I've been trying to mold it so it can look like a book, like a bound oval or circle book. So this is the front, and this is the paper collection, butterflies in there. I sprayed it with uh, um, Lindy Stamp Gain Scintillating Silver. And I used haunted, um, no, it's not haunted shadows, because that's limberness. I used, um, uh, trying to find it. I guess I can't find it, but it's the black, black glimmerness. And, uh, oh no, there it is. Screaming Banshee Black. It's like really dark. So I love it. Um, and I, that was white. And then I just glimmer missed at that. And then look at the bind. I love this. It's so cute. Oops. So cute. And I'm, I left this like this. I may want to write something or put a 
postcard mark or something there. So cute. And then I have my album bound with eyelets and a charm. Oh, the front says, good friends are like stars. You don't always see them, but you know they're always there. And I have some butterflies, two different butterfly punches here. Use my Nest Abilities die, three different ones. And then I have some bling and a glossy accented around the edges. And stands stand on its own. I have it bound with some charms and just a little clip. Let me show you that. I've been playing with it so much, so I'll tangle up. Okay, so the front piece pieces here have get it together. Have a rose charm, and then a big key, and then just some little heart danglies and this little ball chain that I have no idea where I got from. And then the back has this pretty little collection with a bird. And it's just using this little uh, clip here to open. Love, love, love it. Um, who is that calling me here on Ubu? That's Angie. Answer it and see what she's talking about. Okay, where is she? Huh. Okay, Angie. Angie, What's up, girl? Yeah. say hi, you're on my video. Say hi. You're going to be, yeah, they can hear you. <laughs> yeah, it's you too. <laughs> this is Angie at Korean Beast Creations. Angie, say hi. Bye, I'll call you back later. <laughs> She's so, I don't know why she was putting the book over her face because we can't see her. <laughs> but anyway, oh, oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, so anyway, this is the inside. And here is, um, so like I said, these are Angie, ins I'm Angie inspired, Kathy inspired pocket pages. I did, uh, when I finished this book, she was at number two and I was trying to wait to see how she finished it up. So I just finished it out on my own. So it may not be exactly how hers is, but she has these pocket pages that uh, that she made out of the envelope um, cards. So I left my blank because I don't know what I want to put in. I don't know if I want to put pictures and mats. So I left the inside blank, but the outside I left um, uh, matted. Of course, a big place for a photo here. And big place for a photo here. And she has tags in here now that I've... I've um, seen that but I think I'm going to leave that and put something else in there here's a big place for photo mat and I left it pretty empty because because I don't know what I'm going to do as far as um, put pictures in there and I love this one it's so pretty love it so some of them I did matte in the inside and then some I left plain there's a lot there's a lot there's a lot of place for um, photos and journaling so I did put use a journaling spot on this one because there's also, in, on the tops of these envelopes, you can put something in there. So I may go back and add tags later. I, left, I have a lot of paper left. So that's basically how my book goes. You guys get the gist of it. So and that's the back. And then that's the back of the book. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. I am so happy that Kathy did um, the tutorial on this. This actually, this box actually, um, she showed you how to make the box on her toy. I think it was the toy box. No, was it the toy box? It was the travel suitcase, um, how to make the box. So uh, thank you so much, Kathy, for your inspiration. And thank you guys for watching. Please leave a comment. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye.